And people wonder why we're probably going to vote to leave the EU. Oh, it's oh, going to happen. Oh. You never had any American. Count yourself lucky. You don't have. To, I don't have to worry about Trump. <laughs> yeah, that's lucky enough. you. <laughs> I'm telling you, that dumb shit becomes president, and watch, it's gonna at our time for somebody. Well, someone. Price um, you. We reckon someone will kill him. Yeah, I'm a big. Yeah, a lot of people reckon thing. someone will kill Obama too. So. Obama wasn't nearly as bad as everybody made him out to be. True. It's just that um, poor Obama couldn't really do shit with a Republican Senate. He still got the one law that no one wants put through. Yeah. That's Which one? That Obamacare shit. I mean, honestly, my uh, work with the hospital over the last couple of years, which obviously over the last year the has. Shit. Oh, I know. Over the last year, I've gotten a huge insight into how it affects them. It is some bullshit. It makes their jobs about ten times harder. and also makes it so that all the uh, insurances people are used to having for the last, what, 50 years? Only a handful of them are accepted now at most offices. Because of that shit. So patients are getting fucked over now. Makes it so I can actually... Have healthcare should take care of. Like, it's just the opposite for me. It makes it so I can't anymore. Mm. Yeah, well, fucked over. It's heart. because the, mm. the the practice of it, the implementation, was what fucked it up. Yeah, it, it's it was at first it was a good thing, and then Republicans had to be like, oh well, we don't want people to. We're gonna lose money. Blah 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 blah. blah. We're gonna lose money. Oh my god. God forbid you can actually help homeless people. <laughs> All I know is I could afford health coverage before that thing got put in. Afterwards, I haven't been able to afford buying it myself, and guess what? I make enough money to not qualify to get it for free. Same here. Oh yeah, that's can you ask for the emotion? Uh... <laughs> I I it happens from time to time, so. It's gonna be this big ass buff fireman. When he moves over to Texas. Is it Texas? Yeah, it's Texas, isn't it? I'm losing my marbles. Texas. Texas. Well, unless of course V somehow gets shipped back to fucking Mexico. Mexico. Yeah, because she's like a couple of generations Mexican, but that wouldn't stop fucking anti-Mexican wars. <laughs> you know. <sighs> oh yeah, she's a- well, wasn't Trump stupid as saying lately, it doesn't matter if they're citizen or not, he's still sending them all back? Yeah, pretty much. Like, he's the fucking racial bigot, racist, and a. It works for getting them south folks, though. Yeehaw. Pretty much, that's it. Like, I. I he's literally do think our country is saying. so fucking stupid that people are voting for him. Oh, his name. Oh, that guy was on TV. Let's vote for him. Pretty much. I mean, little kids get really excited about going to see Trump because all they've seen is, you're fired. Yeah. I think that's pretty much the only fucking reason he's got any votes. Yeah. But yeah, Trump is special. I don't, I, I don't think there's anything under that weird ass hair. Oh, hell no. I'm in a fucking box of rocks. Yep. It's like um, our new, the new mayor of London was like, so about that banning all Muslims thing. Because <laughs> obviously, uh, the new London mayor is um, 
was with. I'm very proud of it. And it's like, y yeah, you're gonna buy my family and everybody else too. <laughs> it's just probably mind boggles. I am not getting animals. I have a lovely little area for them. Does it have coconuts? coconuts? <laughs> I need coconuts. I do need coconuts. You're in a forest, Sefi, but don't you have to be over 25 blocks away for them to have an ability to spawn? Uh, I, that's why I walk away from the area. No, the thing was, these three cows spawned, like, right where I'm replacing the place at the moment. Hey, let's okay, get back. Who made the Towers of War? That, that's, um, the chance cube. Don't uh, cows only spawn in the ocean. No, they spawn anywhere now. But, uh, yeah, this was Tech J's, like, 15 pound cube that did this. <laughs> well, get a jetpack, fly up, and ores go no or... plenty, yeah. They've even got, like, the, uh, nebus. Hey, you got assaulted by, what, lava from Vix, um, oh, netherrock no from TR, and... <laughs> A box full of explosions from Lighter, and then two other boxes from him, but I don't remember what those had. A box full of explosions? Yep. Fun. Yeah, those explosions? Those cubes are insane. I just have one... Them. I just have one question for you. What? Explosions? Oh, <laughs> yes! I'll take five. Well, no one. I, it was like Verizon was saying. Imagine if someone put like 150 bucks worth down on like 150 pounds worth, and I'm like, oh god, that's it was like 1,000 pounds, oh, and no. it was 1,000 um, US dollars, which equated to 640, 645 dollars or pounds and some odd cents, which I just rounded up, which equated to about roughly 64 um, chance cubes, or the high ones. Yeah. Well, I would see multiple ones. deaths with that. Multiple deaths? No plan. All for a thousand dollars. All for a thousand. You could fuck safer in that world up forever. To be honest, I don't think anyone would be insane enough to drop a thousand on me. Yeah, but after it was all done, she'd have all the resources she'd ever need. If I it's a half and half kind of thing. Assuming she, she survived. survived. Assuming that the world survived. <laughs> Because remember, some of those things don't just affect um, the small areas. Some of them affect the entire area. I know, um... True. Hanger probably got rid of the Ender Dragon and a couple of the mob spawning ones. Uh, those were automatically turned. Ah, alright. Yeah, but I'm awesome. likely going to... That just sounds awesome. Cast. Summon me! Someone summon me! All right, so thanks for stopping in. It was good to see you again. People leaving, going. Yeah. My house smells of Chinese. Hey, mixer, how are you? I'm all right. That mixer fellow again, or Bellis? Bellin. Yeah, you, you Why are you calling him a dick? You almost called him a phallus. It's <laughs> like. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> when in Rome, be a dick. Is that how that saying really goes? Yep. I did not know that. History from Bowser. When in Rome, don't forget there was bestiality, orgies, and rape. Wow. That reminds me of a video I saw last night on a ED stream. It was the history of Japan. Oh god. I would have been a bit of an eye opener. It was nine minutes long and it had like 12 million views. One day I'll have to do a mega build again. Woohoo! I keep waiting for you to prove that you can. Well, you've seen all the pictures. 
How do we know I, what you I wasn't do, though? there to watch them be built. Bro, we know they could have been pictures taken off Google. Yeah, all bye. Faked. Bye. All bye. faked. Bye. Bang. I might not have <laughs> my Xbox 360. You called Baby Raccoon at work. I don't know if that's a cute thing or you end up murdering the poor thing. Oh no! Well, well at least it wasn't a squirrel. Mm. They've been murdering the tulips out back. But yeah, I did build a Final Fantasy IX um, thingy. Uh, I think the bomber. The technical turn? I made Alexander and FF9 version 1. Now, where the hell did this go? Over there. At one place. That's What happens if your little luggage falls off? Oh, Sneak up the back. Lava cow! Oh, no, we're not lucky. Here. Took a selfie. Thank you, T-Bone. I, I, I'm trying to keep it pretty, but of course, with chance cubes in, people are trying to kill me. Oh no, that poor cow's gonna fall off the edge. Come on, cows. Come on. Someone took. <laughs> oh, so someone's got a baby raccoon as a pet. That's kind of cute. Uh, it's weird. Not from what I've heard. Well, <laughs> if it was an adult, right? if it was a baby. No, so. babies are just as bad, at least from what I've heard, because you know yeah, how yeah. kids will like pick up like keys and then like. Put them in their mouth. Well, basically, what the raccoons do is they'll shove keys, coins, anything. The one guy basically had to redo his entire um, sewage water line from his bathroom because his pet raccoon had decided to shove coins and anything else it could get its hands on down the fucking drain in the sink. Oh, wow. Um. I know somebody else, or at least I had read about somebody else, the raccoon had got their hands on it, their wallet. Hands oh. on their wallet. Oh no. So it was shredding like 50, 20 dollar bills and going underneath the floorboards and making a nest. Oh wow. My. There's a moral yeah. to the story. If you have a raccoon, put your shit away. <laughs> Or get one of those little electric mats so when they tread on the wrong place it makes a That won't work, it's a fucking raccoon stuff. They they're like almost as smart as some fucking monkeys. Yeah, the raccoons will <laughs> climb on the power lines. Raccoons are not stupid animals. They'll walk along the power lines like uh like a cat will walk on like a clothesline. Gotta give the raccoon some credit then. <laughs> yep. There is it's a... not all fun in games. They should be this far. Got a pet monkey. Apparently, a baby raccoon is suitably cuddly in the door. Monkey would sit on the bar. Um, but when they put out like the peanuts, monkey would pick it up like a chip. Shove it up his ass, take it out, then eat it. Ew! So after a few a few times of this, people began asking, you know, why the hell is the monkey shoving shit up his ass and then eating it? One day he decided, well, mm. now he can say it. It went really quiet. What the hell happened? Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm not quite sure what happened to the story. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't that really finish out. it. Well, yeah, just decided um, blank. The so the owner people kept asking the owner why is the monkey shoving things up its ass before eating it? The guy says, Well, one day the monkey decided to eat a cue ball, so now he checks to make sure it can come out first before it goes in. 